Now it's time for boom, boom, boom. Rapid fire, rapid fire. So, all right, we got a guest on the day, man. So we do the rapid fire. 10 questions off the top of the dome, but we got a special rapid fire for you today. So it might be closer to 21 questions, man. So when, I don't know. <laughs> uh, hey, I don't know. You don't sing he was to ready. Me. Don't sing to me. Oh, no. Uh, None of that over here. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, here we go. Number one. Hold up, cue that music. Let's go. If you can have dinner with any famous person, living or dead, who would it be? Mm. Right now, it might be Iggy Azalea. <laughs> oh, I would take, uh, take that girl home. Uh-oh. Oh, that's right. Yes, sir. Then we're getting trouble now. I know, I'm trying to All right, yeah, yeah, my bad. Question two, Sam, go ahead. <laughs> Number two, what's the best advice you ever received? Best advice? Well, something that I find very important is to never think that something can't happen to you. You see all the good things and all the bad things that happen to people, especially the bad things, don't ever think that something bad can happen to you, no matter how good things are going, how good you know you have it, your life, you know, how much luck you have, bad shit can and will happen to you. Don't ever forget that. So what is your dream job? I ask myself this fucking question every <laughs> single fucking day. Every day. And I don't know the answer. I have no okay. clue. Okay, cool. No fucking idea. I wish I knew. In 10 years, where do you see yourself? Hmm, 10 years. What am I, 36 or 46? Hopefully I'm still alive. Um, with the way the world is, you know, government yeah. might, you know, take us all out. But, uh, I don't know. Um, <laughs> maybe doing another an episode 587 or episode... Yo, I'll let loose, baby! I'll let loose! I'll let loose! Yes, yeah, sir! <laughs> Real. You can always come back on this yeah. mall. It will be yeah. old as shit. Yeah. Hey, man. Fuck it. <laughs> All right. So what's one of your favorite movies you like to watch over and over again? Ooh, that's a good question. I got a few of those, actually. All right. Talk to me. Step Brothers. Okay. Oh, that's, shit. That's yes, just sir. classic funny as fuck. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, what else? There's a movie called End of Watch with uh, Jake Gyllenhaal in it. And Michael Pena, they're cops. Mm -hmm. It's a good yeah, movie. That's a good fucking movie. Uh, damn, what, else, what movies do I got down there? Uh, that's rapid, that's it, I next can't, question. I, I can't even think. Yeah, that's the, that's, it's the mind fuck part of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So who is uh, the most inspirational person in your life right now? Right now? <laughs> you guys are gonna call me a little bitch on this one. Oh God. But my girl, she, we we bought a new house. She painted. She basically painted both of my our, my kids' rooms. I helped her. She like she did all the um the the lining in of it and stuff. She hung up all their pictures for the most part. She put uh, my daughter's brand new bed together. She fucking she took the whole week off and then this whole house for us off while I was at work and stuff like that. She's fucking independent, she works hard. She's just, she's fucking incredible. And I don't even know why that she decides to <laughs> enjoy this life with me. I don't get it, but. FYI, uh, that was yeah. the correct answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that's the just, only answer, sir. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> right. <laughs> hey, yeah. shout out shout out to your wife, yeah, man. shout out to her. Definitely, definitely. Sure. So my last one, since we just did that one or whatever, what's your celebrity crush other than Iggy Azalea? Ooh, let's see, I got Rihanna. Okay. Hey. Every, dude, the very first time I ever saw her, she Honda replay. I was still yes. in, I was still in high school watching MTV. Watched started watching that video. Called up my homeboy. I said, "Yo, turn MTV on right now. Who the mm -hmm. fuck is this?" Okay. He turned he turned the TV on. He's like, "Oh, oh my god, who, who is that?" I was like, "I don't know, but I'm in love." And I've right. Been, been in love ever since. Go with Riri. Yeah. You know, I actually got flack for defending her uh, a couple weeks ago for the Super Bowl performance. People was hating on me in the yeah, short run. They was hating on me. Little, little Illuminati. 
Yeah, they're oh, crazy, man. man. That's that's crazy. that's her. I mean, that's all they, they had a problem. They had a problem with her coming out grabbing her crotch. When you know Michael Jackson came out grabbing his crotch, every rapper comes yeah. out performs grabs his crotch, but it's cool. Yeah. But it's a yeah, woman, right, so yeah. it's 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 classless. Yeah. It's disgusting. Yeah. yeah. Fuck right. out of here. Everyone's always got a problem with something. Of course. Yeah. All right. Get him, I got, Jay. I got Get one. Jay. I got this shit now. I got this shit <laughs> under control. God damn it. All right. All right. Yo. Question, question number one. What's more important, book smarts or street smarts? Ooh, I, I can't say uh, one is more important than the other. I think they're both equally valuable because, I mean. Which one would you rather have? Which one would I rather have? Ah, uh, shit, probably street smarts because street smarts knows ways to get around things that book smarts don't. So if I'm ever in a jam and I'm street smart, there you go. Yeah, there you go. Me. There you go. For real. Question number two. Best rapper of all time. Well, can I give you my top three? Top yes, five? you can. I would love to hear it. And no specific order. Go for it. Joe Budden. What? What? Did you just say Joe Budden? You're fucking no. with me. No, no, sir. Oh, my God. I need to pump, pump, pump it up. Bro, like, and I say that because I've met him a few times, and he's a chill, chill motherfucker. Um, but like his music, if you like listen to the shit outside of Pump It Up and stuff like that, he's got bars for fucking days. He, oh he's lyrically insane. I'm telling you. And a lot of the stuff that he would rap about, I related to. So that's one reason. Oh my lord. Uh, Eminem, I can't like. Maybe not new Eminem, Obviously. but the, the old shit. Eminem period. Damn it. That's it. Who yeah, else? He, he's legit. So M and M. Uh, uh, the goat. Uh, M. Uh, Joe Budden. Fabulous is high on my list. Apple. Tupac. Tupac. Gotta have Pac. Um, you know, just people like that, man. Like I, when I listen to rap music, man, I, I, I don't care about the the beat as as much. I specifically listen and hear the bars that's all I and that is the complete opposite of what the rap game is about exactly. these day and age right. and i'm gonna, like, and I'm gonna tell you right now we're head. not we're not done with this conversation that's i'm fine. gonna move on but we're not done with that conversation <laughs> i'm gonna bring i'm, 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 I'm gonna get you on, i'm gonna get you on some joe button i promise no no mm -hmm. oh no not i don't miss lifetime I, I don't fuck with joe bud oh, yeah uh, so we'll, we'll have you back on we'll talk about that but let's move on here would you rather be blind or deaf if one bit and if one had to go uh, I would rather be deaf because, okay. yeah, you can't hear anything, but I wouldn't want to miss out on, say I've become blind right now and my kids grow up and they have kids. I'll never know what they look like. I'll never know what my kids look like as adults. You know, I just because I can't hear them doesn't mean that, and you know, it doesn't mean I can't see them. And I, I would treasure, uh, you know, seeing all that rather than hearing it. Hell yeah. Question number four, age you lost your virginity? Uh, 18. Oh, late bloomer, hey. Yeah. I just, I just honestly didn't, I didn't care about it back <laughs> then. I was, all I cared about was hanging out with my boys and hooping and stuff, so. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Listen, kids, you can wait. Right. It ain't that important. Pussy's pussy, right? <laughs> That's right, facts. <laughs> Question number five, the Cowboys win the Super Bowl? Or the Mountaineers win the national championship, which means more? Oh, which means more, West V? Yeah. All day. I, yeah. Because uh, I, 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 I'll admit I've been on the fence of just being like, you know what? I don't have a fucking favorite team in the NFL. I'll have favorite players, and I still do have favorite players that aren't on the Cowboys. But West Virginia wins it all, man. That's, yeah, nothing like it, bro. Big. I that's, feel that's you. That's big, right? Oh, number six, the thing that enrages you most? Stupidity. Good guy. Good answer. Number seven, the best quarterback of all time. NFL. Yeah, you have to go with Tom Brady, right? Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. You don't Thank have to you, go sir. with that. Yeah, you do, because he because he knows what's up, Sam. Seven Super Bowls. Thank like, you. That's seven a team. Of... That's team. That's Bullshit team. it was. The one thing you have to do before you die. One thing I have to do. I like to go skydiving, to be honest. Let's go, brother. I think I'd be fucking dead as fuck. I'd love to go again. I definitely would. I go. I go with well, you. You figured out. Let me know. Talk All to right. Me. For sure. Let's do it. So, number nine, Jordan or LeBron? Uh, 
I, I don't even like this fucking conversation, all right? <laughs> so which one you got, man? Jordan or LeBron? Uh, I can't pick one. I can't do it. God damn it. We ain't never had a question where somebody couldn't pick one. Mm-hmm. I can't. My, my shoe collection would say LeBron, but I don't know. I digress. Unacceptable. Number 10, the official infamous let loose question. Ass or titties, bro? I'm an ass man. I'm an ass man. <laughs> yeah. Twerk, 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 twerk. I like I like tits too, but you gotta have a nice ass man. You gotta have the, the ass, bro. The ass says it all. You can't true. have right. can't have big you can't have nice tits with no ass, but you can have almost no tits with a nice ass. Right? That's what I said. <laughs> That's all what right. I said. Yeah, fair bro. enough. My man said I like the dual fit. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. That's what's up. Well, yeah, man, that'll about wrap it up. Thank you, bro, for joining yes, us, bro. That shit was so fun, bro. Thank so you, you. Just, you just started your new uh, podcast back up. Tell me a little bit about that and where they can find you at real quick, bro. Uh, yeah, so it's on YouTube right now. And it's a, uh, at West V, W-E-S-V-E-E, West V. That's what anybody wants to know where I got it, West V. That's where I got it from. So you can find me on YouTube. You can find me on Facebook, also at West V. I'm going to start working or in TikTok. TikTok is West underscore V. So all those three places, I will po- probably get an Instagram page as well um, here in the coming days or weeks or so. So, you know, go find that shit, like it, subscribe to it, bell notifications, you know, all the bells and whistles. You ready now? I'm about to finish up editing my video and hopefully get it out tonight. So First thing in the morning, go fucking find that shit. When's this coming out? It's coming out uh, tomorrow. All right. So uh, for anyone who sees this, go check that out today. Check it out right after this. Yeah, it's coming out tomorrow. I'll have it out tomorrow. So, yes, oh, sir. Yeah. We, yeah, we appreciate you joining us, brother. We'll have to have you back at some point. And, uh, mm-hmm. yes, yeah, check out my man's reaction videos, man. Y'all subscribe to him. Stay subscribed to us. You know, share the love, man. Everybody eats. All love here. Definitely, definitely. Thank you for coming on, bro. Yes, sir. Appreciate you.